if you were given £2,000 to buy a bike with, what would you get? All of us would buy secondhand a used bike. So when Bicycle, a dedicated online platform for buying and selling bikes, got in touch with exactly that offer, we jumped at the opportunity. What did we buy then? And which one is best? Wow, 6.9 kilos this bike is. Can't get 6.9 with disc brakes. Is it windy? Yeah, you wouldn't know, you've not been on the front. Raining him in. Ah, oh, no, I'm being hunted. No, that's Formula Bloody One, mate. There you go, I'm going to write that down, Formula Bloody One. <laughs> Why would you do that? <laughs> what a <laughs> <laughs> Right. What the hell are we doing here? The weather is absolutely awful. It's probably not the best meeting place, is it? Sorry, guys. Like, what? And this is my bike, one which I can now call my own. It's a Cannondale Super 6 Evo from 2019. I think we can all be in complete agreement. It's absolutely incredible. It actually is incredible. You got that for less than two grand? Yeah, I think it was uh, 17.50. No. So a little bit of cash spare, actually. With envy wheels. And, right, quick run through the bike. Carbon fiber frame, carbon fiber cranks, carbon fiber wheels, envies. The same brand of wheel that Tade Pogaccia uses. Um, Ultegra, 11 speed, super nice new handlebar tape, saddles good, carbon fiber seat post. There is one slight downside to this bike. You. Not me. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Not me. It's a lot more blue than I anticipated from what I looked at on the screen. I thought it was a bit more gray, but that's on me. I do not like the color on it. <laughs> also, it's actually incredibly light. I know I've got a saddlebag and a bottle on here now. 6.9 kilos without is it that actually? stuff on. Oh. It's, it's even, it feels light now. On the other hand, I'm not sure why the handlebars are so wide. Uh, <laughs> you, got, you got rim brakes, mate. You're going to survive. It's yeah, a bit wet. Wet rim brakes. Oh, and. Is that a 23 mil tire? 25. Come on, give me a break. Is it? Yeah. It's a 25. All right, measure it. <laughs> right, come on, that's enough about my bike. I think it looks great. I want to see what you guys have got. All right. What do you think, guys? Wow. I just think it's what a, a sensible what choice. What brand is it? Yeah, no, you might have to stand back to take in the logo. Uh, it's a Trek Amonda SL6 from 2021, okay? And uh, I know you're thinking, it's perhaps a bit of a boring choice compared to Alex with his bling envy, this, that, and the other. But no, I wanted all the mod cons, right? So I turned down a Colnago Superissimo, I think. <laughs> I turned down a specialized S-Works SL5 tarmac. Wow. And I went with this, because I got my disc brakes, I got massive tire clearance. I, I do got... think you've like future-proofed yourself. I have ex it does. That was my thinking. <laughs> yeah, but I think, like the bike is cool, but I feel like it's a sensible, boring person choice to go for that kind of bike. Like, I think you should have been like bolder with your choice. I mean, I could have been bolder, but no, I wanted just like a really good modern bike. I'm impressed. Well, I'm <laughs> genuinely I just can't, impressed. I can't Thanks. wait to see what you've got. Well, you will be impressed then. <laughs> Definitely just a that. bike. <laughs> hey guys, this is my bike. <laughs> Why have you got a what time trial bike? What, what do you mean? What have I done? This is about the best bike and there's nothing faster than a TT bike. And I can do triathlons on it. Well, that's kind of the problem, isn't it? You can do triathlons on it. All right, well, explain what bike is, because having mocked Cy for his giant logo, so I don't think you can go much better. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Vitas Chrono TT. Um, it's, well, in terms of group sets, yeah. right, I've got it covered on all bases because I've got <laughs> everything. What? Literally everything. Yeah, wait, so I've got uh, Dura Ace. Nice. Tiagra brakes. Uh, Campag uh, front mech with a carbon actually the, the front mech cover. I've got SRAM brake levers. <laughs> How uh, can you have all of it? I love it. Oh, there's something else I'm missing, but um, oh, also just got live. Uh, you got live elbow pads. So you got women's, women's arm specific rest. armrests. Yeah. Uh, have you got a fe feminine elbows? <laughs> if that's Ankles a thing. and you're elbows. Find out. Um, 
But yeah, it's it's pretty good. Carbon wheels as well, though. Carbon wheels. So profile profile design. They're about what? They're fifty eight mil. Um, it's super light for a TT bike as well. You've got a this lot is actually probably the bike for the this, money. This is probably you? the lightest TT bike. I've actually, ever I know how much your bike costs, and it was the cheapest out of the lot of them. Thirteen hundred like, quid. Whoa! Coffee's that's a lot. You, of, that's a lot of bike for thirteen hundred quid. You got money to buy a wetsuit and trainers as well, haven't you? That I think exactly actually the whole lunch is on Mark. Yeah. <laughs> Should we ride the bikes? Let's do it. <laughs> It has to be said, buying these bikes was super easy. The bicycle platform makes it very simple for anyone to buy and sell bikes. In fact, you can do it on bicycle.com or via their app. But the advantage of it over other platforms, aside from the quality, the range, and the caliber of bikes on there, is that it adds multiple layers of security and professionalism to the used bike market for both the buyer and the seller, which seems like a great idea, especially with some bikes costing as much as they do. Bicycles sort the shipping between the seller and the buyer, and if the bike isn't as described, you can return it for free, or if there's any damage, then Bicycle will reimburse you for the repairs. And there's more too, some bikes come with warranties, or you can pay a small amount extra for a service check where Bicycle mechanics do anything from deep cleans on the bike to full carbon safety checks. So how are we actually going to decide whose bike is best then? Well, clearly, as ex-pros, <laughs> speed is of great importance yeah. to us. So we are going to have a mass start race of the iconic Cheddar Gorge Climb. Then we're going to focus on all-out speed by doing a time trial. And then because clearly we're all focused on looking incredibly cool, we're going to have a posing competition while standing at a cafe. OK, well, <laughs> since when did we decide that speed was the criteria here. Yeah, yeah, did you miss the memo, Si? What memo? Didn't get a memo, did he? No, I didn't get a memo. I, like, I haven't got MV wheels or blooming time trial handlebars. I've prioritised other things. I've future-proofed. Of course, boring. Why would you do that? Just to get my legs to do the talking. <laughs> Come on, jokers. <laughs> oh, we're off. We're off. <laughs> it was like the surprise start. Oh, we've dropped the trap lead already. We're trying to steal an advantage early. My legs feel really bad today. Oh yeah, that old chestnut. What are the bars in the middle for? The climbing bars? Yeah, that is a problem because that's where my gears are as well. Which gears are working better, Campagnolo or Shimano? <laughs> Having Alex on his featherweight bike oh, no. sat on us. 6.9 kilos this bike is. Can't get 6.9 with disc brakes without spending north of 10,000 pounds. Oh, it's like a river. I'm taking the guys through the bumpiest tarmac I can find because I've got wider tyres. Oh no, that was awful. I can't believe you've done that to me. Ah. Ah. I am not giving you a turn. <laughs> Agree, our bikes are equal. Speed's not important anyway. It's who looks the coolest. You should probably go a bit faster now, Alex. Yeah, yeah. I've been specifically taking it easy. Is it windy? Yeah. You will have now you've not been on the front. Out of sprint, the best sprinter at Tour of Britain 2018. Gonna back off the shade. Me and the bike 
weren't ready for that. You were looking well aero. He looks incredible. But you know what this has proved? Disc brakes are faster, basically, isn't it? Well, we're only a third of the way through the big test. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah I think we've and I've got a good feeling about the next one. <laughs> <laughs> In the middle of the rain and the horrid weather, I just want to take a moment to appreciate the beading on, of water on size forks. I mean, the paint condition on your bike is immaculate. <laughs> Look at that, it's like Spoken brand like new. A true tech nerd, I do like the beading on your forks. <laughs> well, well yeah. the paint's obviously in mega condition. It is, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Right then, now my heart rate has almost come off 180 beats a minute. What's next? Time trial. Just, oh, a, just a really elevate even more. Amazing. I, I feel like. Mark, I feel like this is falling into your territory. This is all I came for today, if I'm honest. <laughs> explain explain why you think your bike is going to excel in the time trial in 10 seconds. Because uh, it's a time trial bike? Area, yeah. Time trial bike. <laughs> I, I, do I need to say anything more? I guess it's, time named, trial bike, it's it? named after the event. I think that in itself describes it enough. Shall we do this? Also, we need to decide on an order. Well, yeah, are we doing a pursuit? So 20 seconds separates each person. Yeah. And I guess the slowest rider goes off first. No, Sly goes first. <laughs> Sly goes first. She has Stefan. Who's second? You, mate. Second slowest, oh, brilliant. Oh, so I'm chasing down. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. The hunted becomes the hunter or something like that. Remember, yeah. Mark, you're doing this to represent 2,000 pound second-hand bikes. Don't, don't let everyone... Oh yeah, don't let everyone down. Beep, 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 beep. I think that was the wrong number of beeps. Yeah. Beep, 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 beep. Oh yeah, right in front of the car. Beep, 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 beep. Poison. You see, if I play this smart, I could wait for Mark, who's probably going to be the fastest, and then I could get a free lift to the finish. And hopefully we'd catch Sai, and hopefully I could take the win. Raining him in. Ah oh, no, I'm being hunted. All right, sit on. Come on, Alex. Play it smart. The water spray is awful. See Sai up the road. Go, okay, go. Okay. I don't want to turn around because I don't want to see Alex and Mark breathing down my neck. This is a savage, savage race. It's like that bit on Zwift, where at the end of a, an interval on a workout, it all goes fuzzy. It's like, in the fog. I don't know where I am. No there. Oh, happy days. Oh my God, what a relief. Look at that, they're together. Thrill will take second. Oh my word. That is officially the worst way of racing ever. I just spent the last 10 minutes crapping myself. How did you get so fast? That was this race, I told you. <laughs> then one minute ago, I was genuinely trying to think of a valid excuse to say right now, and I don't know what to say other than. You just absolutely hauled on that bike. <laughs> oh my God, it wasn't pretty. But I just genuinely, I was like, I just don't want to get caught by Alex in the first two kilometers. So I just went as hard as I possibly could. I think that's what broke me because I thought I would have made progress on you and I just didn't. And then I was like, oh my God. Well, that's the bit that broke me because I caught you quite quickly. I thought, well, I'll catch Si in the next minute. And I kept seeing you and you didn't get any closer. Got it, guys. And as punishment, you can ride the front. Come on. Oh, I don't want to ride behind him going down a hill, mate. I purposely was riding in the puddles, by the way. <laughs> I did. I was raging. I was getting absolutely plastered. Why would you do that? Oh, big puddle. Oh, I might just. Uh... <laughs> what a. <d> <laughs> Thank you.
Okay, we've made it to the cafe. Um, final test of the day. Which is the coolest looking bike? So we've set our bikes up just to the side of us here. We're going to ask uh, members of the public, passers by, yeah. which one looks the best? This Ooh. is the most important one as well, isn't it? Arguably. Also, we need to sort of finalise the results from the time trial. Like, First across the line, wasn't it? Your mark side miles behind. I mean, that is a fair point. You had a 40 second penalty. I mean, I know it definitely wasn't me that won, that's for sure. <laughs> well, well, we'll figure that one out, but in the meantime, Let's get asking uh, some of these passers-by. I just want to ask you, which of those three bikes do you think is the coolest? I think this one. The black and gold one? The black and gold one. Probably the red and black. Red and black? <coughs> I'd say the blue one. The blue one? Oh, All right, cool. Personally, I prefer the blue colour. Oh, the blue one? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to okay. go for the red one. The red one? Yeah. Okay, one blue, one red, perfect. That one. The black one. The black and red, no. black and gold. There we go. Oh wow, we've got a blue over there. No brainer. Yeah. Just the red one. I quite like this one, the black one. Cool. Yeah, How about same. yourself? Same, yeah. One. Yeah, this one. A three to me. <laughs> the black and red one. Yeah. yeah. I'll probably go for the black and red one. Black and red. Excellent choice, I think. I would say I quite like the blue. Do you? Yeah. You sure? So, I, I like blue. Nice you do? Color, yeah. So. I like the blue one. The blue one? <laughs> nah, blue's my favourite colour. Blue one and red and black. Red and black. The black coolest. One. <laughs> Which one? The black and red one? Yeah. No, that's Formula Bloody One, mate. There you go. I'm going to write that down. Formula Bloody One. Thank <laughs> you. There are just two things left to do now. First, we were allowed to buy these bikes on one condition which is that we had to sell them at the end, Aww. which fortunately Bicycle have made the process really easy, but actually parting with this is going to be really hard. I genuinely considered buying my bike, but unfortunately I don't have enough spare money at the moment. <laughs> but what is actually really cool, if you wanted to buy any one of these bikes, we're going to put the links to the individual listings in the description of this video. So. I mean, if you wanted to, you could. Yeah, and the price actually, Bicycle recommend the selling price for you. So uh, it's not like Alex is gonna sign his top tube and then bump the price up. I think if I sign it, it would drop the price down. <laughs> <laughs> All right, finally, we need to figure out the results. Which bike wins? Well, I think we know the results, don't we? Do we? Bike. Easy, this clear. bike is the whoa, winner. Whoa, whoa, whoa. First challenge, third challenge, and potentially the second challenge. I don't think the second, I think I got the second challenge. Mark won the second challenge. We don't clearly. know whether Mark got the second challenge. You're only about 20 seconds ahead, and I started 40 seconds behind you. Yeah. It was the longest 20 seconds of my life waiting for you guys. It arguably was minutes. <laughs> Whatever you two keep arguing about it, let's face it, it's all kind of subjective as to whose bike is the best because we've just found out by asking people which bike they like, and it's kind of like unique and personal to everyone. And if I'm totally honest, I think the draw of a used secondhand bike for most people is whether they like the look of it and it fits in with their budget. Well, also, you get more choice, right? Yeah. So I've bought a nearly new modern bike and it's been amazing. You've bought a super bike, a genuine super <laughs> yeah. bike that's five years old. Like, you don't get that option if you're buying a new bike. And Mark Dude. couldn't decide on a group set, so he thought he'd have everything. <laughs> and it works <laughs> amazingly. It does! It's incredible! I mean, the fact that we just jumped on here today and it's been phenomenal. Yeah. Okay. All right, well, shall we leave it there? If you enjoyed this video, please do give it a big thumbs up. I want to say thanks to Bicycle for helping make this possible. And for what it's worth, let us know in the comments section down below which bike you like the most. And can I also <laughs> add, we're also going to be doing something similar on GTN oh, very soon. Of course, it's going to be wild. Maybe nice. better. You got a bigger budget, didn't you, to buy bikes with? Maybe, so stay tuned for that one. <laughs> right, we're out of here. It's going to get warm. See you later. Bye. <laughs>